Hey guys, I uh, finally got enough of my Eclipse done, so I uh, wanted to make an Eclipse video on them. So yeah, I'll just show off a couple, er, all my Eclipse and talk about some future plans and stuff. So, yeah, I'm waiting for the Red League, er, Sengoku High uh, event. It's supposed to be coming up soon. Then I'll uh, get those, bring my range up by a good bit. So, uh, yeah, 15% luck, solid Golux ring, 8 attack, stuff like that. Not really perfectly scrolled, but the scrolls don't add too much on them, so I don't really worry about that. And here's my uh, Rudabest hat I cubed a while ago. Uh, yeah, it's not really amazing percent luck, but it has decent advanced blessing, and I've heard a bunch of bad stories about how long it took people to get advanced blessing, so not going to really worry about recubing that. Yeah, here's my uh, boss arena emblem right now. I haven't really bothered uh, potentially it or uh, cubing it yet because I want to get a better one first because, you know, it resets the potential on it each time you decide to get a new one, which is really annoying. Here's my uh, Go Ship Exorcist badge. It's only 9% luck right now, but I'm hoping to get it to at least 15% luck uh, relatively soon. Here's my re reverse dual blade mask. Um, yeah, I cubed it during my uh, Miracle Time cubing video a little bit ago. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with uh, the scrolling on this. 31 attack is pretty good for 7 slots. Again, I'm going to try cubing this again at some point. Um, get it to at least 15% luck. This is one of my new pendants. Um, yeah, 15% luck, 31 attack, 44 all scouts. I just got this ring too. Um, so yeah, perfect good superior Golux. 12% luck, 2% uh, all stat nab on it too. And so this is my ring that I definitely need to cube most out of all of them. When I'm doing a boss that it uh, matters on, I uh, use my uh, Beast Tamer critical ring here just because it, <coughs> it brings me up to 100% critical rate and uh, the mini minimal uh, uh, minimum critical damage goes up a little bit too which helps. Um, I'm trying to like, circulate my inner ability to 15% critical so I can just totally replace that with this once I give this to some better percent luck. Here's my uh, other reinforced skull pendant. It's only 6 out of 7 slots right now, but I got it for really cheap. It was like 3 bill, and came 5 out of 7 with uh, 1 slot left, so I just tossed a scroll on it, it worked, and yeah, it was cheap. Okay, this actually is not... These are not my uh, eye accessory. Um, it's one of my friends, Prince2. He has a YouTube channel, too. I'll put up a link in the description. Uh, two, if you're watching this, yeah, I still have your mask. Uh, if you want it back, just let me know. But yeah, I have my own mask, too, that I'm trying to upgrade it relatively soon. Yeah, it's not quite as good as the one that I'm bartering right now. Yeah, here's my uh, reinforced earrings. 42 attack. Perfect did just generic 15% luck and then 4% all stat nub. I tossed 8 enhancements on it because uh, there was an event a while back where you could, uh, you got a bunch of free protection scrolls and stuff because Nexon screwed up with something. So I, mine were about to expire and I needed something to use it on, so I just used them all in a bunch of regular equip enhancement scrolls to get the state stars. Master of All Knowledge me uh, Metal. Hoping they release a better one at some point. Here's my card. I'm pretty happy with the pot and everything on it. 60% uh, boss is great, and 35% PDR really helps at root of this and stuff. So, yep. And, yeah, the bonus potential, of course. I'm really annoyed with that because I spent so m oh, There's a hundred percent. 120 uh, bonus pot cubes between this and my cane, and I couldn't get 15% attack or legendary on either of them, but whatever. Uh, so, 
here's my shoulder I bought it a while back I don't think I have any videos of it in it though yet so yeah um 12 attack with 13 attack bonus spots at 25 attack then 18% luck with uh 2% luck nub um so here's my top again it's not really that amazing probably going to sell it at some point and buy a better one don't really want to waste cubes on it because it's not scroll grid either don't really have any way of scrolling it currently so yeah 11 attack 14% luck and here's my cane uh, overall I'm pretty happy with it uh, 309 attack I cubed that 70% boss and 9% critical rate which is pretty good cubing compared to how well I usually cube seems like I can only get good potential with cubing uh, when I'm cubing weapons cubing armor and everything I I never can get like stacked luck lines or anything so yeah 70% boss is nice and 9% crit uh, helps on a phantom too because you want to hit 100% critical rate 9% uh, attack of course which again I'm not too happy about but whatever this is my reinforced string uh, 5 out of 6 right now um, once they release an event with clean slates I'll finish off uh, the last slot on this and my pendant right there so yeah 15% luck 25 attack and yeah so here's well pocket slot I'm working on getting my charm to 30 it's kinda slow and I'm not very dedicated to it right now it's just 19 I'm hoping they'll have an event where I can just get a trait booster uh, potion get lucky and uh, get my charm to 30 with that but they also in the event shops shops sometimes have uh, something that just unlocks your pocket slots I'm hoping for that too because I uh, have that pocket item right there which will add a little bit to my range see so here's my uh, tyrant belt seven stars 12% um, luck with a uh, 3% nub I'm probably going to try recubing that at some point but yeah right now I have other things to do so yeah my pants um, not the best rolling job on these uh, <laughs> plus six attack in five slots it's not amazing and nine percent all stats decent hyper body again I'm probably going to sell these at some point and buy some better ones maybe get like a hyper body nub on my new ones and get another line of uh, percent luck yeah so my heroes gloves you saw my uh, dojo vid video uh, earlier probably I got 545 in that one. When I got the when I got these gloves, I got 536 in Dojo. Um, it's because I um, it's because I got this ring. I didn't quite have this pendant yet, cause, so it could be a little bit faster. And also, I wasn't borrowing any gloves at that time because yeah, I was just using my uh, sharp eyes gloves. I wasn't borrowing any attack gloves from anybody that run. So I'm pretty happy with 536. Um, so yeah, my Tyrant Cape, 7 stars, 18% luck pot, uh, 2% bonus pot, and 3% nub. Um, honestly, that's the highest percent luck I've ever cubed myself, which is pretty bad. <laughs> um, so yeah, my heart just generic, 72 attack. Um, they're supposed to be releasing some new hearts, um, or at least uh, new hearts were in the extractions. Um, they were like nine slots uh, unhammered, and they were uh, tier three for potential, which is kind of ridiculous. Um, honestly, I'm not too happy with that because I don't really want to waste the money on another heart right now, so I might hold off on that for a little bit. Yeah, here's my tyrant shoes. I actually gotten pretty lucky with the scrolling on them. Uh, seven attack or. 8 attack, I think. I think it'd be 49 attack. Uh, I wasn't scrolled. Yeah, I think uh, it's plus 8 attack in uh, 3 slots. If I ham it, hammer it again and chaos it, I could get it higher. Might do that at some point, but it won't make a huge difference. So, yeah. 57 attack, 15% uh, luck pot, 3 attack bonus pot, and 3% luck nub. 
and here's my codex. Um, just using the future Henesis uh, set right now. Uh, yeah, it's three attack or three percent attack. Um, and if I'm doing any bosses with really high PDR, like Chaos Root Abyss or something like that, I'll use my uh, Leaf set with thirty percent PDR. So yeah, um, I'm hoping that Nexon releases like the Philosopher book event or something again so uh, Nebulites will get common and cheap again. So I'll put like 3% uh, luck nebs on every single one of my equips. That should add somewhere around 30% uh, luck which will boost my range up by a bunch. So yeah, right now my range is 812k clean. Um, but Phantom's ranges go up by like a ton with buffs. So here's all my buffs. And fully buffed right now my range is uh about one point eight five mil a little bit above it. So, yeah, my damage with various skills. So, with mil is, it's uh, right around 5 mil, a little bit under. Um, somewhere around 6 to 7 mil with Blaster. The cards are. It gets hard to read the damage on Blaster because the cards that fly out whenever I do a critical hit. Because those cards have a little bit higher damage than the than Blaster does actually. So yeah, then with heroic memories, uh, 1.92 ish uh, buff range. And terms and conditions, two mil to two mil. So yeah, uh, that's about it. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later.